Make a red one next, Daddy. Okay, Jeffy. Coming up. That was a ping pong ball you put in a yellow glass. Oh, oops. Let's put Grandma on one of the eggs and mail it to her. You can't mail an egg, Dolly. You can if you put enough stamps on it. Let's color jelly beans next. Dying eggs isn't the same as killing them, is it, Daddy? Not at all, Dolly. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. The cracked one can be for PJ. Can we eat some Easter candy now? After church tomorrow, Jeffy. Is this a good dress? I got some color on it. How long do we have to stay here and help you, Daddy? Remember these, Bill? Where in the world did you find it? It wasn't my high school box. Let me see, let me see. I want to see, too. Me next. It's the Easter Bunny. What's he doing? He's hiding eggs. Why does the Easter Bunny hide our eggs, Mommy? Hmm. I don't think anyone ever asked that question, Dolly. I'll bet the Easter Bunny is going to hide the eggs where PJ can't find any. He is not. He is, too. The Easter Bunny doesn't know PJ is just a little baby. Well, we can't do anything about that, Dolly. Yes, we can. Fred Astaire conducts the Easter train. I'm an old friend of the Easter Bunny. Lots of friends are helping the Easter Bunny deliver his Easter goodies this year. But there are others out to stop him. That train must never get over Big Rock Mountain. The Easter Bunny is determined to get through, no matter what stands in his path. Today at 5.30 on 19. <laughs> The good things always come easy at your nearby 7-Eleven store. 7-Eleven has Coke, Diet Coke, Cherry Coke, and Sprite. Just 99 cents for a big two-liter bottle. And Frito-Lay Big Grab packages. All flavors, two for only 79 cents. And healthy Tropicana juices. Orange, grapefruit, or apple. Just $1.19 a quart. At 7-Eleven, get the good things easy. his pajamas. Billy, come on. PJ will see this one as soon as he comes out. I don't see how he can miss this one. Is this right, Dolly? That's a good one, Jeffy. Why does the Easter Bunny hide eggs anyway? Mommy said no one ever asks that question. Well, I want to know. I want to know, too. Get a 
that surprise. Why aren't your hiding places right before our eyes? Why not in our pockets? Why not in our shoes? We think we can solve the mystery if we had some other clues. Hey there, Easter Bunny! Do you know what we've done? Give us a part of the action, a share in some of the fun. Hard-boiled egg cost 50 cents when you send it U.S. mail. Why not where we can see them? Why do you make it so hard? You always look so friendly on last year's Easter card. You know what I'm afraid of? When the Easter Bunny comes, he's going to find the eggs and hide them again where PJ can't find them. Dolly, you can find more things to worry about. Do you know what we have to do? We have to go back to bed. That's what we have to do. Billy, I'm never going to help you do anything. Okay, what do you want to do? Remember on TV, on Wild Animal Kingdom, we saw Marlon Brando catch animals? We have to catch the Easter Bunny and keep him until PJ finds all his eggs. Mira! Catch the Easter Bunny? Sure. We'll dig a pit. Dolly, we can't catch the Easter Bunny. Why not? Because you can't. Why not? We'll get into trouble, that's why not. Come on, Jeffy. Get that stick. gonna take till next Easter. Dig faster! I have a better idea. Jeffy, go in the house and get some carrots. Bunny is under the box. We pull the string. What's that? Carrots! The Easter Bunny's not a baby, Jeffy. We need a real carrot, Jeffy. Do you think we'll catch anything? Kitty Cat, you're not the Easter Bunny. Here, Kitty Cat, I have your favorite cat food here. I'll have to go get her. I don't believe it. We caught the Easter. 
Easter Bunny. What are we going to do? We caught the Easter Bunny. Mommy's awake. She's coming out. What are you all doing up so early? Dolly couldn't sleep. Neither could Billy. What do you have under that box? Uh, what box? That box. This box? Nothing. Lift it up. We can't. The Easter Bunny will get out. The Easter Bunny? We caught the Easter Bunny. Really? Let me see him. Goodness, where did he come from? It's the Easter Bunny. We caught him. We have to keep him for a while. Let's keep him for a couple of files. I'm sure he'd rather be somewhere else. You'd better let him go. I told you, Dolly. He has to hide lots of eggs, right, Mommy? What's going on? We've captured the Easter Bunny, but we're going to have to let him go. Please, Mommy, can't we keep him just until PJ finds some eggs? PJ will find them right away, Mommy. We hid them right out in the open. Okay, but promise me you'll turn the bunny loose as soon as the egg hunt is over. We promise, Mommy. We promise. Let's get the baskets. I'm gonna find the most eggs. Come on, PJ. Happy Easter, Phil. Happy Easter, love. Look around, PJ. You're gonna find lots of eggs, PJ. PJ, I'll bet there's an egg right around here someplace. Come on, PJ. I wonder if there's one over here on this bucket. What's this over here, PJ? Better find some eggs before Jeffy gets them all. Don't cry, dear. <laughs> I'm sure you'll find some eggs. I got the most eggs. PJ didn't find any. Poor PJ. There you go, PJ. Now you have lots of eggs. Look at all the eggs you have. You can have my eggs too, PJ. <laughs> there, there, dear. We did our best. What more could we do? I know you tried, Billy and Dolly. And you too, Jeffy. PJ just couldn't seem to find them. Maybe he needs glasses like Daddy. I think we can let the bunny out now. Please, Mommy, can't we keep him a little while longer? Remember your promise. We better let him out, Dolly. He has lots of work to do. Will someone open the gate, please? Goodbye, Easter Bunny. Easter Bunny. You have to leave, Easter Bunny. He doesn't want to go. You'll have to shoo him out. Won't he go barefoot? Please, Mommy. It's not right to keep him here, Dolly. Time to go, Easter Bunny. He ran in the house. Easter Bunny, come back. You didn't want P. 
your feet. Now he'll never, ever get to hide his eggs. Easter Bunny, come out. Where are you? Here, Easter Bunny. Where are you, Bunny? Come on out. I have a carrot for you. Did the Easter Bunny come out? No, Dolly. He's still in the house. How are we going to get him out? the Easter Bunny for us, Barfy. Make him come out, boy. I think Barfy found the Easter Bunny. Chase him out here, Barfy. Stand back. Here they come. like in the picture egg. Can we look at it again, Mommy? Let's go. Oh, this is so pretty. Take a look. Listen, dear girls and boys, I am gratified. To let you share the secret that's kept you mystified. Why do you, Mr. Bunny, on this hippity hoppity day, insist on a game of hide and seek in your own peculiar way? Why don't you make it simple? Forget about surprise. Why aren't your hiding places right before? I could make it simple, give you a treasure map, and tell everyone exactly where all the eggs are at. It would be so much easier you take a tip from us and you place them on the toy chest near our hippopotamus. If you take a friend's advice, we can both agree that what is truly valuable never comes that easily. Why not where we can see them? Why do you make it so hard? You always look so friendly on last year's Easter card. Gather round, me, children. Step into my magic world. Let that old calliope set your mind to work. Can you really keep a secret? Do you really want to know? 
Here's the biggest chance you'll get to watch my traveling show. Now you see it, now you don't. If you don't try, you surely won't. Listen to the magic of the musical notes. Everywhere the sound of the Calabi floats. Dad, Dad, Mary, Melody. Send you skipping down the path. Send you skipping down the path. Send you skipping down the path to discovery. So you think you know where it's hidden? How I made it disappear? Where do you think it really went? When you know it isn't here. You might think I'm only fooling. It's part of my technique. When I'm out hiding Easter eggs, I'm playing hide and seek. Now you see it, now you don't. If you don't try, you surely won't. Listen to the magic of the musical notes. Everywhere the sound of the Calabi floats. Mad that merry melody. Send you skipping on the path. Send you skipping on the path. Send you skipping on the path to discovery. But it's much more than a sleight of hand. Much more than a game. I carefully hide each Easter egg to make it harder for you to claim. When you actually find it, and it's resting in your hand, there's a joy in the discovery and a world at your command. Now you see it, now you don't. If you don't try, you surely won't. Listen to the magic of the musical notes. Everywhere the sound of the calabi floats. Let that merry melody send you skipping down the path. Send you skipping down the path. Send you skipping down the path to discovery. I must be going, girls and boys. Because I've got lots more work to do to hide millions of these eggs without ever leaving a clue. So, a final word to one and all to guide you on your way. Discovery is just around the corner, and tomorrow is another day. Now you see it, now you don't. If you don't try, you surely won't. Listen to the magic of the musical notes. Everywhere the sound of the calabi floats. Let that merry melody send you skipping down the path. Send you skipping down the path. Send you skipping down the path to discovery. Best buys like 20 Ace Heavy Duty Trash Bags for $249. Ace is the place. An Ace Round Point Shovel for $299 after rebate. And Wells Lamont Cowhide Work Gloves for $499 with free canvas gloves. Ace is the place. Nothing else tastes anything like them. Cadbury's milk chocolate makes up the shell, rich cream of vanilla, and the most delicious golden candy yolk any egg ever had. They're in the stores now, but they won't be long. Just until Easter, then they'll be gone. Cadbury's Easter cream eggs. Ooh. You can get them wherever you buy candy bars. But just until Easter. I said a prayer that the Easter Bunny gets all his work done.
You're looking at a very unusual kind of egg from Cadbury that's only around till Easter. Its shell is pure, rich Cadbury milk chocolate. But look, inside sits a sweet, creamy yellow yolk surrounded by delicious white filling. Cream eggs from Cadbury. Why, they're the best thing to come along since the Easter Bunny. And when he's gone, they're gone. shape our future. We invite you to learn the technology of tomorrow while you serve your country in the Navy of today. Candy from Mego, complete with Sweetheart Compact, our price $6.97. And on sale this week, Shopper's Max Machine Nighthawk, the sound control van, just $13.99. Coleco's head-to-head -head electronic sports games, one for every major sport, only $29.88 each. And as Peter Panda says, it's so nice to know that prices are low and shopping is friendly and fun. The trees are putting out new leaves and blossoms. Yep, it seems like after that long winter, the whole world's wide awake again. <laughs> well, almost the whole world. Now, Rusty, you know how important hibernation is to a bear. Just be patient. Mm. But maybe something will wake him up by accident. Huh? <laughs> hey, Button! <laughs> you finally woke up! Now we can go out and play! Huh? Uh, uh, okay. Uh, sure. Bridget, you're awake. And my, have you lost weight. <gasps> oh, 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 so would you if you'd been on a crash diet all winter. <laughs> well, <laughs> we'll soon fix that. Breakfast is almost ready. Hold it. And where do you think you're going without eating? Oh, Mom. As soon as your father wakes up, we're going to eat. Nothing ever wakes Pop. Mm. Mm. That smelled awful good. Why didn't somebody wake me? Come on, kids. Breakfast's ready. Thanks, Mom. Bye. Let's take the good old secret shortcut. Yeah, the good old secret shortcut. Remember any fork in the tunnel? Well, I made some improvements while you were hibernating. Come on! 
Gee, Rusty, your new shortcut's a lot of fun. Ouch! That's strange. Last time I tried it, there was a big mound of nice soft snow right here. Hey, look, there's Skipper and Bluebell. Huh? Oh, Buttons and Rusty. Hi. Uh hi, Bella. What's with all the flowers? Oh, these? Uh, oh, we, we grind them up and use them for coloring. Yeah, yellow. Really? What for? Oh, it, it's kind of a surprise. Don't tell anybody. Don't tell anybody what? Shh, it's supposed to be a surprise. Ah, uh, we have to go. Oh, okay. See you around. Never try to figure out a rabbit. There's Ranger Jones. Let's go. There, that should do it. Hi, Ranger Jones. Well, well, well. If it isn't my favorite cubs in all of Chucklewood Park. <laughs> you had enough hibernation, Buttons? Yes, sir. Well, you picked a good time to wake up because the day after tomorrow, you're both invited to the Chucklewood Easter picnic. Easter? What's Easter, Jonesy? Well, Easter means a lot of different things to different people. Hop in and I'll tell you about it. Yeah, I love Deep Run. Oh, boy, great! All around the world about this time, folks celebrate the new life bursting out everywhere. And the one who spreads the joy of Easter to all the young'uns around these parts is the Easter Bunny. The Easter Bunny? Who's he? Well, very few folks have actually seen the Easter Bunny, but he's the one who leaves presents for all the young'uns. Presents? Gee! Sure. Baskets of painted eggs, candy, all kinds of goodies. Wow, Easter sounds like fun. <laughs> That's why we're having a picnic. There'll be an Easter egg hunt and an egg decorating contest. Oh, boy, I can hardly wait. I've got a lot of posters to put up, so I'll see you at the picnic. Okay, bye, Jonesy. Thanks for the ride. Hey, Buttons, what do you say we start decorating eggs right away? Great idea, but we don't have any eggs. Not yet, but there's got to be a ton of eggs around here. <laughs> Mmm, sun sure feels good on a body. Do you like today you almost feel like coming out of your shell? We'll just borrow wood. Yeah, we'll take it home and paint it and then put it back before she even notices it was gone. You know, Buttons, we're gonna need more than just one egg if we want to become experts. <laughs> Perfect color. One perfect coral, only from Revlon. He says I'm a gorgeous blonde. I say I'm a smart blonde. I use preference. The color is rich with subtle shadings, and my hair has such life. Well, that's the preference difference. He thinks I'm worth it. He's right. Performing preference from L'Oreal. Corning see-through vision saucepan withstands heat that turns ordinary saucepans into sauce. Best of all, it lets you see your meal before it's all over. Visions by Corning. It's visibly superior. Zodi saves your money on things for your patio, for your bath, your kitchen, and everyday living. Now, Zodi brings you a Mother's Day special. Choose from four fabulous wind tuck sweaters. Cable, bubble, diamond, and tulip patterns with pearl buttons and straighter scallop waists. Warm your mother's heart with a wind tuck sweater. Only $7.99 each. Yes, a Zodi special purchase. Only $7.99. Take a look at Decorate eggs for the critters picnic. That's nice. Help yourself to some berry juice. Thanks, Mom. Two, three, four. Oh no! Ranger Jones! Ranger Jones! Help! Help! Oh, Ranger Jones! Hey, we know what's wrong. It's gone. All I did was take a little paddle to cool off, and when I came back, you have to find. Ranger Jones! Now calm yourself, Edwina. Find what? One of my precious eggs is gone! Are you sure, Edwina? Maybe one of them rolled out of the nest somehow. Or maybe a plane miscounted? It's a crime! It's a crime, Ranger Jones! Gertrude, you too? 
There's an egg burglar on the loose in Chucklewood. He took one of my eggs. Me too, me too. Who took my egg? Yes, who's the culprit? Who, who? Uh, well. There. You think this is how the Easter Bunny paints his eggs? I don't know. There's something missing. Yeah, yellow. We need some yellow. Wait, remember what Skipper and Bluebell were using for yellow? Buttercups. What are we waiting for? First, we better leave these near the stove so the color will dry. This egg burglar must be brought to justice, Ranger Jones. <laughs> now, now, there must be a reason why someone took your eggs. Maybe this has something to do with it. The egg decorating contest? But we weren't going to use your eggs. Well, maybe I'd better stop putting up these posters. Now, don't worry. We'll find your eggs. See? Yellow. That's great, Rusty. But maybe we better get home so we'll have time to put the eggs back where we got them. Yeah, I guess. Hey, look. Skipper and Bluebell. Tell us all about the Easter Bunny. Yeah, is that who the flowers are for? Well, in a way. Sure they are. Right. You mean you know the Easter Bunny? Doesn't everyone? Where does he live? Sorry, Buttons, but that's a secret only rabbits are allowed to know. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because if everyone found out that the Easter Bunny lives down in the... Come on, Bluebell, the sun's going down, and you know what that means. Gee, I wish we could see the Easter Bunny once. Uh-huh. But Skipper's right, Rusty. The sun's getting awful low. If we don't get home soon... Hmm. Okay. I guess we've got enough buttercups. You were right, Buttons. It's too late to take the eggs back now. But what are we gonna do? We'll get up real early tomorrow morning before any of the other critters wake up and put the eggs back in their nests. Yeah. And who knows? Maybe we'll even bump into the Easter Bunny. Don't look now, Rusty, but... Yikes! <laughs> it's the Easter Bunny! A whole bunch of Easter Bunnies! It's Skipper and Bluebell. I wonder where they're going. You don't suppose. <laughs> they're going faster. They must have spotted us. Buttons, I can't see where I'm going. Oh, Buttons, you okay? Help! Buttons! A lot of love and care goes into making Easter baskets fun for your loved ones. And Care Bears can make them even more fun because a Care Bears tummy shows just what you're feeling in your heart. Tender heart, dear. Oh, where was the best Easter basket I ever got? Cheers, bedtime and friends. They're my favorite Care Bears. And your grandma's favorites, too. Care Bears are each sold separately. Give one to someone special this Easter and share your special feelings of love. But I guess there's nobody around to ask. Except rabbits. Hundreds of rabbits. Buttons, we're back on the trail. <laughs> wow. Do you think that's where the Easter Bunny lives? Let's go find out. But they won't let us in there, Rusty. We're not rabbits. Not yet. Watch this. Okay, twitch your nose. 
Like this? Good. Now my turn. Well, just tell them to be sure and let me know if they hear anything about the missing eggs. Bye now. Bye! Eggs! Mm, what about them? The cubs did say something about decorating some eggs. We'd better take a look around the cave. Well, the important thing about eggs is that they stay warm. And then, of course, we'd have to get them back to their nests. Well, we don't have to worry about the first part. These are plenty warm. But how do we tell where each of them came from? Mm, let's see. Uh, this big one is obviously a duck egg. Isn't that a turtle egg, Abner? Nope. Trust me, Bridget, I know what I'm talking about. There isn't much time, folks, so why don't we divide them up between us? Oh, yeah, yeah good idea. Come on, let's, let's get, get going. going here. <laughs> There's something funny about you two fellas. Ross? Look, uh, we can't keep our pal Skipper waiting. Uh, hi, Skipper. How's everything coming? Huh? You know these new guys, Skipper. You could say that. Shall we do? Okay. They're our favorite fox cub and bear cub and all of Chucklewood Park. Fox cub, bear cub? You invited a fox and a bear into the Easter Bunny burrow? Well, we didn't exactly invite them. Do you know what would happen if everyone found out there's a fox and a bear in here? Did he say a fox? And bear? I knew there was something funny about those two, but don't worry, we'll take care of them. <laughs> Up there! Let's go! Take it here! Look out! All right, what's all this commotion about? Now let's all get that book. Oh! Quick, everyone, use the dipper to fish him out. Easter Bunny, can you hear us? Oh, what happened to the Easter Bunny? That looks like the turtle nest. But how do we get to it? Easy. Use those stepping stones. Here's your missing egg, Mrs. Turtle. And about time, Toe. Winnie, here you are. 
Don't worry, your egg's still warm. Gee, it looks different from the others. You think this'll hold me, George? What was that? So, you're the egg napper. Come back for more, did ya? Well, take this! Wait, you don't understand. There, that's the last of them. Oh, my friends! I can't thank you enough! You're welcome. And so, my fellow rabbits, we must consider the seriousness of what these intruders have done. Not only have they been pretending to be rabbits... But, but let me explain your rabbitness! Not only have they interfered with Easter basket production... We didn't mean to! But look what they've done to our wonderful Easter bunny! Skipper, Bluebell, you know we didn't mean any harm, don't you? Well, that's, that's right. They didn't mean any harm. Anyone can see they're sorry. Fellow rabbits, let's confer. You are hereby banished. You will be taken away to the wilderness. The wilderness? What is the wilderness? The wilderness? Why, it's a place where you can't do any harm even if you try! A place where no rabbits run! A place where no birds fly! No birds? No birds! Rusty, the eggs! The eggs! We can't be banished to the wilderness yet! We've got to put the eggs back in their nests! What? what? Come on, buttons, run! I'm free again. Now, what is to be done with you two? Here she comes, finally. <laughs> two shells? That's strange. I've never seen a duckling with two shells. Here, how about these berries? No, there's got to be something you like. I want all these eggs individually wrapped by tonight. Easter Bunny! Easter Bunny, wait! <laughs> really? <laughs> Is that so? Well, this changes everything. What's happening? I don't know. Ahem. Uh, well, apparently there is a more pressing problem back in the park. You two are going to have to undo what you did when you took those eggs from their nest without permission. What do we have to do? You'll know what to do when you see what has happened. You mean we can go? Yes. But, Skipper, make sure you blindfold them first so they won't know their way back here. Well, you folks look real elegant, I gotta say. Oh, oh Ranger Jones. Jones. When do we eat? As soon as the others arrive. Well, here's the duck family. I think. Come on, Eustace, you can do it. Oh, I don't know what's wrong with this young one. Awake all night, sleep all day. Well, that was quite a day. You could say that again. Say, where did you cubs get to all this time anyway? We went to see the Easter Bunny. Oh, <laughs> oh sure you did. It's true. My goodness, look. There's a note. Dear Buttons and Rusty, I hope you've learned now to keep your noses out of other critters' nests. Good because it wouldn't be right if you were the only cubs in Chucklewood Park to come home to an empty basket. So, happy Easter! Signed, the Easter Bunny! That's the way I like to see things wind up, because everyone deserves a Chucklewood kind of Easter. this week.
Hasbro's Hungry Hungry Hippos, the hippos that munch marbles, only $8.97. Knickerbocker's Dolly Pops Pop Down, it's all day fun, just $12.87. Computer Command from LJN, program a 1980 Corvette and watch it go, only $29.97. And as Peter Panda says, it's so nice to know that prices are low and shopping is friendly and fun. Child world, everything I do is going to be. Ink is the place. Hey, Gene, can you give me a hand here? Be right with you, John. Thanks. Let me tell you, Gene's my favorite helpful hardware person. She knows everything. How to fix stuff, what tools to use, the right kind of paint to buy. Hey, there's nothing she doesn't know. So how can I help you today, John? I just got a couple jobs. Well, nothing we can't handle. Let's start with the toggle bolts. Toggle bolts? Ace is the place. She knows just what to do and how to do it. Hey, let me tell you, Ace is a place for me. Which came first, the chicken or the egg? Well, at Coryell, it really doesn't matter. I'm Cookie Chick. That's right, Cookie Chick. And both the chocolate-covered egg and myself are custom-decorated Carvel ice cream cakes made fresh daily at participating Carvel ice cream stores for Easter. Now, would you like to send one to a friend? Please call the toll-free number that you see listed here, and we honor most major credit cards. Thank you. Surprised to see me here instead of Santa Claus? Well, I can't say that I blame you since it is Christmas here. Me? Just call me GB for now. Yep, I'm back in time, many Christmases ago. And right there in that very house is where our story begins, the story of the first Easter rabbit. And you know, we came within a hair's breadth, if you'll excuse the pun, of never having an Easter rabbit at all. Don't remember, do you? You know all about Christmas and Christmassy things. Like how Santa came to be, Frosty, and Rudolph who guided the sleigh. But how about that rabbit who comes every Easter day? Wear for spring during the Easter sale at Target. Save 30% on active tops and bottoms for men, women, and juniors. Target sale price from $5.59 to $13.99 apiece. And save 30% on fashion tops and shorts for boys and girls. Sale price from $4.19 to $6.99 apiece. Target, we've got the look, we've got the price. Spring active wear for the whole family. 30% off during the Easter sale at Target. See that little guy with a sprig of holly in his stuffed paws? That's one special rabbit. Though I admit he may not look like it right now. He was a Christmas present for a little girl named Glinda. Oh, Mommy, I love him. Thank you. I love him. I'm glad, dear. You'll have to think of a name for him. I will. 
but for now I'll call him Stuffy. Oh, look, it snowed last night. Can I go outside now, please? Yes, dear, but be sure to bundle up. Meanwhile, in the nearby woods, a trio of real live rabbits were hatching a ridiculous caper. Now, let me get this straight. We're gonna dig a long tunnel under all the carrot patches in the neighborhood while nobody's around. And when spring comes, we're gonna come back and steal the carrots from underneath. Totally undetected. We come not, friends, to steal your hearts, but your carrots. You've now met spats, whiskers, and flops, three of the slickest con bunnies around. Alas, my men. Behold that silly-looking rabbit sitting over there. Hey, look. He's strange. He hasn't got any hind legs. <laughs> His odor is unsniffable, undetectable. He ain't a rabbit at all. He isn't real. But I am real. I am. I am. Poor Stuffy. He knew he wasn't real like the other rabbits. And that made him very unhappy. But he was Glinda's favorite toy, and as the months passed, so did his sadness, because he was loved. But one day something happened that was to affect everybody's life. Little Glinda took ill. I'm afraid it's scarlet fever. Oh, dear. My poor little girl, what can I do? Well, the first thing is to burn all of the bedclothes. And oh yes, that old stuffed rabbit, burn it all at once. Now taking away a child's favorite toy is no easy matter. And how would she ever explain to little Glinda that Stuffy had to be, well, you know, even I hate to say it. Oh dear, it's getting late. I think I'll leave all this for burning tomorrow. Our rabbit friend thought to himself, what's the use of being loved if it all ends like this? Who, who are you? My name is Calliope. I take care of all the playthings that the children have loved. And when they're old or worn out, <laughs> then I come and take them away with me and turn them into real. Why? Wasn't I real before? You were real to the little girl who loved you. And now you should be real to everyone. Stuffy was mystified, but he hadn't heard the most important part. Now that you are real, I have a special mission for you. You have been chosen to be the first Easter rabbit. But why me? I'm nobody. And why do we need an Easter rabbit? A good question, wouldn't you say? But Calliope had a good answer. She explained to Stuffy why all the holidays of the year needed symbols to help people remember them. Springtime needs someone to remind all the children of her special holiday. They could form the lovely habit of saying Easter's here cause there's that rabbit. There's that rabbit Taking some blue from the sky There's that rabbit Mixing a buttercup dye There's that rabbit Painting his green everywhere A magical hair That rabbit That rabbit, that rabbit, helping the spring do her tricks. There's that rabbit, that rabbit, chiseling chocolate chicks. There's that rabbit, that rabbit, far from your typical jack. Each year he'll be back. That rabbit. needs a little old me. <laughs> There's that rabbit. There's that rabbit. Playing his egg rolling game. There's 
staff rabbit, rabbit. Everyone's calling his name. There's that rabbit. rabbit. Easter's his garden to tend. Our cottontail friend. That rabbit. Dudley Rabbit here. Easter's almost here, so hurry up with those eggs. Hi, I'm Clara Clucker. Dudley asked me to tell all you moms about his new improved shaken egg. It makes Easter eggs that are downright egg sighting. <laughs> Get it? So, well, come on, Mom, I'll show you. Just pour Dudley's dazzling new dye mix into the shaker bag. Now dip a hard-boiled egg in warm water, put it in the bag, and just shake away. <laughs> Isn't that fun? Oh, and here's what's new. Dudley's new formula dies and dries instantly, right in the bag. Have you ever seen such wonderful colors? So, Mom, take it from me, Clara Clucker, and this year get Dudley's own shaken egg, the better-than-ever way to color Easter eggs. And look for Clara Clucker's happy Easter egg, the colorful giant blow-up egg with pictures of me and all my Easter friends at fine stores everywhere. And to begin... You must go to Easter Valley, where the golden Easter lily blooms. And it's always springtime. It's over the hills, to the west of the sun, and beyond the third mountain. <laughs> but now someone will show you the way. Easter is only two weeks away, so hurry, 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 hurry. But beware, beware of zero. zero, 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 zero. But who? How? Oh, wait, don't, don't go. I have so many questions. Think I'll begin with a hop. He's coming around just a nasty bump on the noggin. What's your handle, kid? My name? It's, uh, it's... Gee, I, I almost forgot. <laughs> I'm the new Easter rabbit. Boy, he's a dilly, isn't he? And, uh, where were you hopping to so madly? I'm off to find Easter Valley, where the golden Easter lily is, and... Hmm, golden Easter lily, eh? <laughs> Excuse us for a moment. Since you're obviously not in the best of health, my companions and I feel it our duty to accompany you on your journey. Gee, that's great. Let's get started. Zero, 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 zero. But beware of zero? What was that? Oh, nothing. Nothing at all. But it was something indeed, for the Easter rabbit had remembered Calliope's warning about zero. Bruce? Bruce? I'm coming! Ooh, ooh, zero! Bruce? What have you found out about the road into Easter Valley? Did the elves know anything? Not a thing! Not a thing! I give up! You see, Zero and Bruce were in charge of keeping the North Pole nice and white. Everything was all lovely and covered with snow except Easter Valley. Zero had never been able to find the secret road into Easter Valley, and so it stayed green all the year long. We can't give up, Bruce. We just can't. There has to be a way. <laughs> For those of you who have never shopped at Marshall's, we'd like to tell you who we are and what we do. Marshall's is nationwide, with stores from Maine to California. Since 1956, we've continued to bring our customers and their families brand name fashions for less. Less than department and specialty store regular prices. How do we do it? Well, most stores order their merchandise before the start of each season. Marshall's waits until the season has started, because that's when the merchandise is available at lower wholesale prices. Our distribution center also keeps costs down. It's efficient and keeps a constant flow of new and different merchandise going out to every one of our stores. Because of the way Marshalls buys and processes its merchandise, we can offer it to you for less, a lot less. It's that simple. So why spend more for brand name fashions when you don't have to? Be a smart shopper and discover Marshalls. Brand names for less.
Well, by the time our friends had reached the third mountain, they were totally exhausted and ready to turn back. I say, it seems that bird is indicating a direction to follow. What have we got to lose? Someone will show you the way. She's leading us away from the wall. If you ask me, we're barking up the wrong tree. What do you think, Flops? I'd say we were barking up the wrong tree. The tree. It must be hollow. Why doesn't one of us give it a try? I shall be as expeditious as possible, okay? And be quick about it, too. Calculations are correct. He should reach the other side just about now. I am calling you. <laughs> Hang in there, Flops. We're coming over. Everything you could imagine was there. And one person who seemed downright out of place, Santa Claus. <laughs> just trying to be neighborly. You see, I'm all finished with my job. And I had a little spare time, so I thought I might be able to help you get started. But we'll never be able to do the job in time. There are so many boys and girls all over the world, and we only have a few weeks. Well, why not pick just one small town for a test? And then next year you can tackle them all. That's what I did first time out. Great idea, Santa. And I know just the town. Excuse me for buttoning into the festivities, Santa, but what's in it for us? Giving presents is a talent, one that the three of you have obviously never had a chance to explore. Why not try it just once, hmm? You can start by giving just a little gift of love to a child. You'll be surprised at how much you'll get back in return. You won't regret helping me, fellas. Uh, just one thing, Santa, sir. Is he really the first Easter Rabbit? <laughs> well, indeed he is, Spats. Now I must be off. Blitzen, good luck. <laughs> good luck. Well, they've gone and done it, Bruce. Somehow they've managed to get into Easter Valley, and they're bound to find the Golden Lily got to find a way in. Crafty old Zero knew one thing that no one had bothered to tell the new Easter rabbit, that the golden Easter lily kept the valley warm and green all year long. If it were to disappear, springtime would disappear with it. So glum, chum. Oh, it's nothing. It's just that I've been thinking about little Glinda again. How is she, Doctor? She's sleeping now. She's going to be just fine. Oh, thank you, Doctor. That's that's the best thing I could hear. Oh, I forgot. She seems to be mumbling something about somebody called Stuff or Stuffy or something. Oh, he was her favorite toy. <laughs> A silly old stuffed rabbit. Oh. Well, I'm sure she'll forget about it in a few days. Now, you spend a little time looking after yourself for a change. Goodbye, Doctor, and thank you. Stuffy, oh, Stuffy, you've come back, you've come back. Linda, what are you doing out of bed? And what was that noise I heard in here? Oh, Mother, it was Stuffy. He came back, he came back. And he was really real. And there's going to be a parade and everything on Easter Sunday. Come now, dear. Let's get back into bed. And I'm going to wear my new pink dress and my new straw bonnet that you got me. Mother, all of my clothes, where are they? Glenda's mother had no choice but to tell her the truth. Don't cry, Mother. Who needs silly old parades anyway? Oh, darling. Oh. Monday, it's 
Flash Spiegel with Snoopy's secret life where Charlie Brown loses pooch to life in the past lane. Then it's a comedy extravaganza, the all-new Daffy Ducks Easter show. Own your own two-piece trimline telephone for only $25. It's a White Flower Day special in electronics tomorrow only at Macy's. This white carnation is the symbol of the most popular savings event around, White Flower Day. One day only, only at Macy's. You know that. White Flower Day means outstanding savings on every floor. You know that, too. But did you know White Flower Day is tomorrow at all Macy's? Well, now you do. White Flower Day. White Flower Day. It's that tree down there. It must be hollow. Ooh, ooh. That's the way in the Easter Valley. I'm sure of it. Excellent, Bruce. Excellent. <laughs> tomorrow, Bruce. Tomorrow will be the end. The end of Easter Valley. <laughs> Well, the next day was Saturday, the day before Easter Sunday. I think we shall have a white Easter, if my eyes do not deceive me. A white what? Hey, look, it's beginning to snow. Yeah, it's really coming down. Now I've got it all. <laughs> the valley and the golden lily are mine. Gee, Zero, are you just gonna leave them snowed in like that? Ooh, ooh, they may never get out. Bruce? Who cares? <laughs> Let them all freeze for all I care. <laughs> Bruce was beginning to have second thoughts about what they had done. Bruce decided there was only one thing left for him to do. So he rolled, getting fatter by the minute. It's as if someone out there doesn't like us. Oh, it's, it's uh, stuck. The snow must be up to the roof. I can't budge it an inch. Santa! Santa! I gotta speak to you. Bruce told Santa the situation, and Santa knew what he had to do. Ahoy down there! Come on up, it's me, Santa Claus. Santa Claus! I know what's happened. Bring everything up the chimney and begin loading the sleigh. They loaded all the eggs and baskets and bonnets onto the sleigh, and just as it was getting dark, they had finished and were on their way. He came. Stuffy was here. Mother, mother, look. And there's a note with mine. It says, don't forget our date. Main Street and 5th Avenue at 12 noon sharp. Well... Morning, Elizabeth. Why, good morning, Doctor. We didn't expect you today, being it's Easter Sunday and all. <laughs> Jonathan, please. And this is not a professional call. I brought these for you and Glinda. Uh, uh, Jonathan, you shouldn't have. Oh, it's beautiful. Can I try it on, Mother? Oh, of course not. Now hurry. Uh, the parade starts at noon. The news is all over town. But how did you know we needed... <laughs> A little bird told me. <laughs> Stuffy, oh, Stuffy, you're here. Never saw you look quite so pretty before. Never saw you dress Quite so lovely, what's more? 
I could hardly wait to keep our date this lovely Easter morning. And my heart beat fast as you When they look you over, I'll be the proudest fellow in the Easter parade. In your Easter bonnet, with all the frills upon it, you'll be the grandest lady in the Easter parade I'll be all in clover and when they look you over I'll be the proudest fellow in the Easter parade on the avenue on the avenue Fifth Avenue Fifth Avenue the photographers will snap us and you'll find that you're in the rota gravure Oh, I could write a sonnet About your Easter bond And of the girl I'm taking To the Easter You miserable roly-poly snitcher When I get my hands on you I will melt you down to a tennis ball You will do nothing I'm warning you, Zero Either you put the golden Easter lily back in the valley So that springtime can come back Or I'm moving out of the pole I've got a good offer from the South Pole, you know And I've been considering it You'd leave me all alone here? No elves, no Sunday night dinner with Mrs. Claus's home cooking and those little noodles at home. No midnight rides with the reindeer. Just me all alone here by myself. By myself. <laughs> what good is all of this? What? is anything without friends to share it. <laughs> I'd even miss Bruce. Oh. <laughs> hey, who's that? Me? I'm Zero. Sorry to drip and run, but this weather is bad for my health. Bye. And oh yes, happy Easter. Gee, he doesn't seem like such a bad guy. I wonder what all the fuss was about. Well, at least this time we've got a year's start. Huh, Whiskers? Right you are, GB. So you found me out at the very end. That's right, I was stuffy. Many, many years ago, that is. And so the Easter lily brought eternal spring with it. The chickens could lay their eggs and the world would know that next year and every year I'd be back again. Happy Easter!
slashing prices now at Circuit City's Price Slasher Sale. Save on great brands like this GE 19-inch color TV with remote control. Its price is slashed to just $248. Now through Sunday, this Panasonic beeperless remote telephone answering machine, only $64. We're slashing prices now through Sunday. Circuit City, the intelligent choice. I'm John London. Join Alan Thick and me for all the fun of the Walt Disney World Happy Easter Parade. Live from the Magic Kingdom and Epcot Center, Easter Sunday on ABC. I love Easter. I just wish Grandma could be with me. She'd love my new bonnet. She'd say over and under and slip it on through. If you want to show someone you love that they are a part of your life this Easter, there's a very special way to do it. Give a Hallmark Easter card. Grandma remembered. Hallmark, when you care enough to send the very best. <laughs> 